How's it going? I'm here with another GM mode, and in the last one, we got off to a fantastic start. 25 wins! 25, 9, and 2. Fantastic start. Let's get back into it. Uh, Alright, let's... Uh, I want to go to the trade deadline. I think we got... Actually, you know what? I, I, let's go to uh, the start of February. Because I changed up the lines a little bit, and if they're not working, I, I need to change them back. So, all right, uh, so we're, we're doing all right, I guess. Uh, just time will tell. I mean, obviously, we can't keep up the performance that we uh, did in the first 36 games of the season, but uh, there we go. Management has been on the ball of late. It's great. Thanks a lot. No effect. All right, that's fine. I just don't want to have a negative effect. Ooh, Tyler Sagan's a little unhappy. Hedman's a little unhappy. I think it's because we've been losing a couple games. All right. Game against LA. Let's get back to the winning ways. There we go. Oh, man. Ooh. Back-to-back -back losses. When was the last time that happened? Oh, man. We can't string together any wins. You know, I'm, uh, I'm going to stop it right after this game against New York. I got to put our lines back to how they were. Player morale. Uh, Klingberg wants to talk. Team performance is really a non-issue. I'm happy with it. Well, that's good because we're doing good. Uh... I agree, things seem to be going really nicely. No effect, alright. After this New York game, uh... I'm ch- Uh, you know what, we just won. Uh... You know what, we're coming back down to earth a little bit. We've won, we've won uh, six games, and we've lost one, two, three, four, five... And, okay, so we're 6-5-1 in the last month. I'm just going to keep going with it. Uh, I think we're coming back down to earth a little bit. Let's go up to uh, the end of February. Okay, so hopefully we can string together some wins. Get back to our... Uh... Oh, shoot, I lost. Come on. Oh, scouting time. Here we go. Uh, let's go to the U.S. They got 20 forwards. Actually, who's got a bunch of defensemen? WHL. Let's go defense. Six weeks. Here we go. All right. So uh, three all and one in the last four. That's good. Player morale. Who wants to talk? Klingberg again. Extra ice. I mean, your uh, first line power play and penalty kill. So you are getting some extra ice time. Uh. Great, we found a good balance. It seems like that second choice is usually the best. It's either no effect or positive. There's ne almost never negative. I like that. Okay, so uh, yeah, we're starting to string some wins together now. That's good. There we go. I see. I can handle. I can handle a loss every now and again. We're just doing fantastic. Eight. Oh my god, 12 goals in those past two games. 17 and 2 in the past three games. That's fantastic. We're just on a roll again here. Oh my god, 40 wins. It's not even the end of February yet. I am definitely not changing anything at the trade deadline. Oh my god. We didn't ha we had one regulation loss in the entire month of February. That's fantastic. Oh, I just got to keep this going now. Uh, yeah, I'm not even stopping for the trade down line. Let's just keep going. Actually, you know what? I want, I'd... All right, play the game against Colorado. I want to take a look at the stats again. We're about two-thirds of the way through the season. Oh, my God. Tyler Sagan, he's keeping his numbers up from last year. He's fantastic. The guy's on fire. Oh my god, 29 goals, 43 assists. The guy just can't be stopped. Oh my god. And then Jamie Benn, too. He's still playing fantastically. 
He's a point of point of game now. That's great. JVR, uh, since his move up to the first line, he's been doing good. Mantha, still been working it on that second line. He's still getting first line power play too. Klingberg's getting some points. Dauphin's starting to work it. Pavel Zalicha, he's starting to get some more points now too. I wish, I think that, oh, Sadin's not even on the same line as him. I, I would say I wish Sadin would help him out a little bit, but uh, he's on the second line. I think maybe I got to move uh, Zacha back up to the second line. No, no, things are going great right now. I can't change it. Cannot do a thing. I just got to keep running with it. I actually want to see where our uh, team stands. Uh, we're first in the division by 21 points. Oh my god, we got 10 more wins than the next best team. Oh, we got 9 more points than the Edmonton Oilers. But we got a game on them, but I don't think that matters. Oh my god, we are in the lead for the President's Trophy right now. We got 43 wins, 15 losses, and 5 overtime losses. That's fantastic. We're having a fantastic season, and we just got to keep it up. Alright, so I, I'm not touching a thing. I'm just going to... You know, I want to simulate to the end of March. You know, what's the point of even simulate, simulating the end of March? I should have just went to the end of the season. Uh, I... You know what? Uh, edit trade block. I want to put uh, some picks on there. Okay, uh, no, I want this year. Man, how they sort these is terrible. Alright, so I want to... You know, I don't even need picks this year. What am I trying to do? Man, we're just we're going on a streak. We're streaking. <laughs> we're like Patrick Kane. <laughs> oh, it's, and, uh, man, when he uh, after he won the cup in uh, 2012, I think it was. Yeah. Uh, so, how do you guys think about the streak? Did somebody say streak? <laughs> At a scouting assignment. Uh, let's go to the SHL. Let's get forwards for a month. They only got 11 of them. We've gotten a couple losses here. Oh, okay, we we got it. We got it going again. That's good. <sighs> Man, we can score goals. If that's one thing we can do, we can score goals. And then our defense is on sometimes and it's off sometimes, but we can score goals. 50, 19, and 6. And we still got seven games left. I, I There's nothing really I need to do. Everything is being solved for me. I mean, we got... We got seven more games left. We're already in a playoff spot. <laughs> I, I don't have anything to complain about now. How can Luke Green be upset about ice time? He's getting... He's on the third line. He's getting first line power play time. Player morale. Who wants to talk? Clutterbuck. Ooh, how did you become best friends with Todd Grease or whatever the hell his name is? Your contract's up after this season. And we're not even sure if we're going to resign. I would love to, but if you don't want to be here, I still need you to give your best effort if you want to win a cup. I want you to be a role model in this locker room. Positive effect. Yeah, I like it. You gotta be hard on them sometimes. Oh, Jesus. We got a 93 and a 94 on the first line. That's... Oh, my God. And our def our first line defense is a 91 and a 92. And we got an 89 in net. We just got some fantastic players here in Dallas. The fans love it. I love it. Oh, come on. Let's get a couple wins here in April. We gotta go hot into the playoffs. Overtime win. Can we get the, la the last one of the season? And we do 6-3. to three. That's a way to head into the playoffs. Let's edit the scouting assignment. Uh, let's go back to the SHL. I want to get the defense for uh, four weeks. There we go. Alright. Uh, regular season. I, know, I just got to... I want to go up to the 
start of the playoffs here. All right, so we're going to be playing the Chicago Blackhawks. I got to look how everybody did. Tyler second. Oh, my God. 97 points. Oh, Jesus. That's fantastic. Oh, my God. One less than last year, but he had more assists. Probably, be, oh, Jamie Benn had a fantastic season, too. So he's probably passing him the puck a lot more. Uh, he had 90 points for Jamie Benn. That's the most he's had ever in a season, I believe. Yeah, 2014, 2015, he only had 87. Oh, God, what the hell? There we go. Yeah. Most points he's ever had in a season. That's fantastic. He was a plus 11 too, so it wasn't like he didn't play defense. 22 power play goals too. 34 goals in total. We got a good team here. We got a great team here in Dallas. Anthony Mantha chipping in 66. Wish he would have gotten a bit more. But I think he set a career high. Oh, he tied a career high. Oh, okay, maybe not. Okay, yeah, he tied a career high, 66 points, 20 goal season, 46 assists. Uh, next year, you're going to be even better, dude. I just know it. JVR chipping in with 61. What's his career high? Career high to 68, so uh, not, not a career season, but uh, still a great season by him. Split in first and second line time on the second power play. Klingberg, 58 points, even after the update. Still getting it done. Laurent Dauphin, uh, 41 points. See, I wish he would have done a little bit better. I believed in him. I think he did all right. Hopefully, he'll improve and he'll have a better season next year. I'm expecting a better season next year. Because he is only a depth forward this year. Hopefully his role gets raised. And uh, he can be better for us next year. And in the coming years. Pominville. Sign him to a one year deal. Did I sign him or did I trade for him? I don't remember. Jason Pominville. 38 points. Playing on the third line most of the year I believe. I don't even know if he got power play time. Still fantastic. Pavel Zaucha, 20 goal season. He had 21. Excuse me. And uh, 35 points. You know, for a rookie season, that's not too bad. Compared to what he did to the a in the AHL last year, it's better. So he he's going to continue to get better. He's only 22. He's still got elite potential. He's going to be a great player for us. <coughs> oh, man, I need some water. Ugh. Jason Dickinson, rookie year. He's playing on the fourth line. He should have been on the third, but we just didn't have a spot for him. He did all right. Luke Green in his rookie year, 85 overall. Now, man, he's going to be great for us. He's still on that rookie year deal. Uh, Victor Hedman had a little bit of a disappointing season, but uh, Henrik Sedin, this is probably his last year. He'll be gone after this. But still, he gave us a fantastic year. He gave us all he had. That's great. Victor Hedman, I wish I could have gotten a little more out of him, but I'm not going to complain. The team did well. Delzato, uh, you know, he's uh, he's still got one more year on his contract. He's going to be a uh, top six defenseman. That's what his role is now. Going into the playoffs, I think that's what I'll have him as. And I'm going to make that change right now just so I don't forget. Edit the lines. Let's go to the defense. Uh, oh, Delzato is there. You know, I gotta, I gotta get Luke Green more playing time. Demirs are gonna go down. Yeah, I gotta get him more playing time. He's fantastic. His shot, his puck skills, his offensive win, it's all fantastic. Man, if I didn't have Klingberg or Hedman, he would definitely be on the first line. All right, uh, let's hold a team meeting too. Anybody want? Jamie Ben wants to talk. It's been on the ball as late. Thanks a lot. I mean, it means a lot. There we go. Hold the team meeting. It's a great accomplishment, boys. There we go. All right. Luke Green and Cal Clutterbuck liked it. Nobody else. The only thing I care about with team meetings is that there is nobody who doesn't like it. 
So if even if there's only one person who does, it's still a positive. Let, let's look, take a look at the team stats. First in the division, of course. We clinched the conference. And, uh, ooh, by three points. And let's see if we won the President's Trophy. Yes, we did. Oh, this feels good. We're going in as the best team in the entire league. Everybody's got a target on us. They're looking to uh, beat us because we proved we were the best in the regular season. Now we just got to go and prove it in the playoffs. Let's take a look at the playoff tree. All right, so we'll be playing Chicago in the first round. St. Louis has got Colorado, Edmonton, San Jose, and Anaheim, Nashville. In Pittsburgh, New York Islanders, Washington, Philly, Buffalo, Tampa, and Montreal, New Jersey. And those are the matchups in the East. Looking like a good playoffs. I got a, I got a great feeling about the Dallas Stars. But that'll have to wait until next time. I'll see ya.